Okay, good. What we're going to do here today is we're going to compare some of the different window insulator products available. Uh, we're dealing with the best one, which is inflector window insulators, and they've got a number of varieties that we're going to be checking out today. We're going to start off with the regular inflector insulator, and what we're going to do is see how much stop heat it stops. Right here we're showing 100% of the heat from this heat lamp hitting the meter. So we're going to introduce, just to start off a single pane piece of glass, and what we can quickly see is that 88% of the heat still goes through a single pane piece of glass in either direction. So a lot of the heat is going through. So let's see how some of the inflector products compare. This is the regular inflector screen. We're going to put it in between as it goes. What we're seeing, inflector, all the regular inflector all by itself is stopping 78% of all the heat. And with the single pane piece of glass, now we're down to 19% of the heat. So we're going all the way from 86% of the heat coming through with the inflector insulator. Now we're down to only 19% of the heat coming through. Okay, now let's compare some of the other products we have available from inflector. Next we're going to try the product that is going to be called the SR15. This is a superior reflectivity product and it has less visible light transmittance but more energy efficiency, but you can still see through it. This is your SR15. The same as your regular inflector, but with less visible light transmittance for superior reflectivity. Okay, again, we're going to try it all by itself. Wow, an extra 10%. You're down to only 12% of the solar heat gain, 11 to 12% of the solar heat gain, just using this alone. But it does work with existing glass. So if it was work with a single pane piece of glass, now you're down to a 90%. So all the way we're 80 six percent of the heat's coming through down to only ten percent is coming through with the SR15. This is really a phenomenal product for heat rejection and radiant heat rejection. That's the SR15. So now we've checked those two, but we're also going to look at while we've got this thing out, we're going to look at the, that's also the SR15. We're going to look at a brand new product here that we're going to be calling the thermal Break. This is a break that, that is made with the Inflector BZ product. And you know I should show the BZ real quick. Hold on that thought for a few seconds. Here. This is the Inflector BZ. The Inflector BZ is the same as the Inflector, but without the last thing. So air can pass through this, but the solar and radiant heat is stopped. So again, you've seen the other numbers. See, what you get with the BZ is you get more of the heat coming through, but it will also take the air will pass through it. So you still got a solar and radiant heat block but allows air to pass. So now we're going to try that BZ. So what you're seeing is 68% stopped again on a regular piece of glass, 86% blocked with the BZ. Now you're all the way down to 28%, a massive difference, but this will let the air pass through. Now again, the new product that we're going to be showing you here also is the thermal brake. The thermal brake is made with the BZ material but with a polycarbonate on both sides of it. So again, let's see what the performance is all by itself. 31% with the polycarbonate and that. Now again, with the single pane piece of glass, now we're down to 27%. So all the way from 86% down to 27 percent. Massive change. So what you're saying is, what you're seeing here is a lot of great options to get much greater energy efficiency with window insulators. So you got options of performance and different ways that you can achieve it. You can let the air pass, you can not let the air pass, you can have more visible light transmittance or less visible light transmittance. You can have a solid piece or you can have a flexible piece, the others being flexible. So what we've got is a lot of different options to solve window insulation problems with the inflector and all these changes. Regular inflector, inflector SR15, BZ, and the NP. And we've also got NP, which lets none of the light come through. It's a blackout material. There are blackout materials in the market, but NP is even better because the NP has energy efficiency plus the blocking. So it has all the ingredients. So there you have it. All your Great options to insulate your windows available 
the inflector window insulators. And where can we find this product at? What's the website? Website is going to be energyefficiencydr.com is a great place that has all the testing or inflectorpanel.net. Again, Energy Efficiency DR has all the great testing on this product and has been extensively tested by some of the greatest laboratories. And, and if you have any questions, what's your email address? Email Dennis at Energy Efficiency DR or Keith at Energy Efficiency DR. Dot com, okay. And is your phone number? You want to uh, give me your phone number? 210-650-0854. Feel free to call us with any questions. This is a great way to address the energy consumption and heat loss and heat gain in buildings and homes. Okay. Well, thank you so much. Uh, we appreciate your time. And your name is? Dennis Roberts, President of Energy Efficiency Done Right. Well, we appreciate your time so much, uh, Mr. Roberts. And uh, you got inflector uh, BZ, inflector NP, inflector SR. SR15, and you got your thermal break uh, yeah, and there. Inflector. So uh, we appreciate that and look forward to making this more energy efficient planet. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you.